Medical news this evening, an autistic girl from South Florida traveling to Costa Rica for what her family is calling a life-altering treatment. Since having adult stem cell therapy, she's talking and interacting like other children. Seven's Richard Lemus shows us how this is all for autism. Family videos show Patricia Cabrera as a bright-eyed, happy baby. But her parents would soon watch their active baby transform into a reclusive toddler. It started basically with not being able to speak. Then from there, we noticed that she didn't socialize with anybody. By age three, doctors diagnosed Patricia with autism, and her behavior got worse and worse. She had no language. Everything was a scream. The family tried every therapy and drug available. Got to the point that we knew that we had to do something. When our oldest daughter comes to us and says, will she ever speak to me? And right there we said, that's it. We got to find something. That something would be adult stem cell therapy. It's been used to treat other disorders. So they thought, why not autism? After they couldn't find any doctors here in the U.S. to do it, they found a clinic in Costa Rica, the Institute of Cellular Medicine, who agreed to treat Patricia. And they said, listen, we've never done this, but if you guys are willing to take the chance, we'll take the chance along with you. And we told them, well, worst case scenario, what's going to happen? They says either she's going to come back the same or she'll change, she'll get better. He says, but guaranteed she won't get any worse. They took that chance. For four days, Patricia received injections of stem cells. These are not the controversial embryonic cells, but cells taken from umbilical cords or bone marrow. All it is is cells from the body that have the potential to become any cell in the body. Cells are thought to help autistic children by boosting blood flow to the brain and helping with autoimmune deficiencies. Back at home, Patricia's family immediately saw a different child emerge. It's been a total, complete, drastic change. One day she's saying milk, and the next day she's saying, I want milk. Three, four, five. After a second round of treatments, Patricia can now count to 50, string together sentences, and went from bottom of her class to the top. I noticed a tremendous change in her behavior, in her social and communication skills. Patricia's South Florida pediatrician saw the progress firsthand. She remains hopeful, but skeptical over the stem cell treatment. We still have to do research. We need to make sure this is what's helping her. One, two, Patricia's parents believe it's working. They're waiting for the day their little girl